I think when we are feeling uninspired, the best thing to do is to go out and look for it. That's what I did this day. A sky with very subtle and pastel tones. A sea basically flat with very small waves. A quietness. A seascape without a contrast, apparently. I thought to myself, there has to be an image here. What am I trying to tell here this time? I'm in the environment I like the most. No worries in my head, focused on the here and now, but I can't seem to find anything to express myself today. Okay, an idea just popped into my head. I'll go for the intimate seascape. I'll grab my telephone lens and look for any interesting details in the sea and the sand. Not much going on at the skies today, but I want to emphasize and give a new look for the water's edge. I just had a glimpse of how this would look when the first rays of sunlight hit the, the sand and water. A nice texture to the sand and a bright reflection on the small waves. That could work, but this time I'll forget about tripods, I will just do some ICM, intentional camera movement, and let it flow. No constraints, really. Just to get the proper exposure and shoot instinctively just as I did in this video here, where I talk about mixing photography. When the daylight gets more intense, I'll just drop an ND filter to achieve a proper exposure to slow down my shutter speed. And so, I've started my capturing process. First, I would try to move the camera in circles, making a circular shape, and also some variations. Why a circle, you say? I don't know, there's no explanation for something so instinctive that came rushing into me. I just felt I needed to do it that way. How long has it been since you let go of all technicalities and focused more on how you're feeling? I did a thousand a hundred and twenty seven photographs this morning, and later on. I selected only 10 out of it. A process in which I was so immersed as I was when I was capturing it. <laughs> 